What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Cam ATL. Shout out to the DFS squad. Shout out to everybody watching this video right now. Drop a like down below because I already know you're gonna love it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Make sure you comment anything down in the comment section to enter your name into the $50 giveaway that we do every single week on this channel. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the little notification next to subscribe so it lets you know when I go live. I normally go live about 2.30 p.m. Central. All right? We smashed the Sunday slate. Thank you, Lord. I needed that W, man. I've been struggling here a little bit lately. MLB can be like that sometimes. It can be pretty damn tilting at times. You're doing everything right. All the matchups are perfect, and yet they just don't show up. But today was a breakout game, and I'm excited for this new week, man. GreenlightDFS.com. Join the squad. I am going to comment the winner of last week's $50 giveaway down in the comment section, so make sure you scroll down and see if your name is typed down there to see if you're the winner. And if you are, hit me up on Twitter, at Cam underscore ATL. Now I have a special prize for you guys this week, all right? Instead of $50 for this, for this next week's giveaway, I'm going to announce it next Monday. Instead of $50, I'm so excited about NFL coming, I'm doubling that. I'm making it $100 to one commenter under one of the videos. I'm going to be like I do every single time. Make sure you comment under every video throughout the week to enter your name all those times. And I'm randomly going to choose a video, scroll down, and choose a commenter. So make sure you comment on every video, and that person will win $100 next Monday when I announce it. All right, thank you guys for watching. As always, let's get straight into this slate. Starting off at pitcher, J.A. Happ and Sonny Gray. Now, Sonny Gray's price does not make me happy. I'm going to be completely real with you. It does not make me happy. The matchup does against a whole bunch of righties in a very pitcher-friendly ballpark. Like, the matchup, by far, is the best of any pitcher on the slate. Sonny Gray is probably the best by a mile on this slate as well. I love Sonny Gray, and there's really no spots you really have to pay up for on this slate. It's kind of like a pick-and-choose uh, slate where there's nobody you really got to spend up for. Like, there's no games in cores. There's no, like, super expensive Houston bats and stuff like that. So you should be able to have a good outing. And the stack that I'm really focused on um, from first look is a lot of these New York bats um, going against lefty Tommy Malone, okay? Um, the starter is going to be Weisler in that game, but then Tommy Malone's going to be the long reliever. Malone hasn't been horrible, but he's still a left-handed pitcher against a New York team who mashes lefties. Judge, Sanchez, Torres... All those dudes are in play for me, and a lot of them are going to be in the home run predictions, if not all, but I'm going to get to that in a little bit. But at the end of the video, by the way, home run predictions. Now, Sonny Gray's matchup is just fantastic. Um, I love his chances. At 11-2, like I said, there's nowhere you really got to spend up, so just go Sonny Gray. Don't overthink it. The matchup is crazy. I know Miami has blown dreams a bunch of times this year. That's baseball. But at the end of the day, this Miami offense is not good. Tons of righties in that offense. So just stick with it. Sonny Gray should have a great outing here. A, a righty against a bunch of righties. Recipe for perfection. Love him at 11-2. J.A. Happ. Now, J.A. Happ at 7-1. Or I was also looking at Dustin May against San Diego. But for the huge savings that we get for J.A. Happ... Like, the price difference between those dudes, Dustin May is 8-5 compared to J.A. Happ being 7-1. Now, I know Happ has had his struggles, okay? But he's still a lefty going against a Seattle squad full of lefties who also lost a ton of their best batters. At the end of the day, now, I get the Seattle offense has been doing okay. They've been the major crusher of dreams throughout most of the season. Like, they're not a good offense at all. One of the worst offenses in the entire league. They have a ton of strikeout-prone lefties in this lineup, okay? I absolutely love J.A. Happ, lefty going against this squad. I also love New York on the other side to give him some run support. Fire up J.A. Happ at 7-1. I love J.A. Happ at 7-1. Now, now, I do really love this value here, and this is my value dong of the day. Ryan O'Hearn at only 2-5. That price is great, okay? I believe, let me just verify, I believe he double-donged. Yeah, he just double-donged on the 25th, okay? Uh, obviously, I don't expect that again, but he should definitely come in with some confidence here. And going against Homer Bailey, the righty, lefty-righty matchup, Homer Bailey was known as a gas can for most of last year, and then he kind of turned things around and did a little better. So far this year, he hasn't been horrible, but it's still Homer Bailey, okay? And at 2-5... A guy with the type of power that Ryan O'Hearn has, I just wanted to put him in the high five because that price is 
really, really cheap, and I can see him homering for you guys at a really cheap price. Next up, Aaron Judge and Jorge Soler. You guys know how much I love Soler, and you know how much I love Aaron Judge against lefties. Aaron Judge has finally snapped out of that cold spell he was going through, and he's been smashing the ball lately. He's been hitting the ball very, very consistently. He's been doing very, very well, and this is the time to jump back on board to Aaron Judge, going against lefty Tommy Malone, who will be the long reliever, like I said. Um, Weisler will be the starter, but Tommy Malone, the lefty, will be the long reliever. He will be on in their majority of the game. And Aaron Judge, Gary Sanchez, and Glaber Torres are all in play for me against Tommy Malone. Jorge Soler, I don't need to explain this much. I have a man crush on him. You guys all know that. I, I predict this dude to homer damn near every day, probably. And he's just got ridiculous power. He mashes righties, okay? He's a guy that mashes righties even more than lefties, okay? He hits righties amazing. And he's going against Homer Bailey, who, like I said, has turned a corner and done a little bit better. But I don't believe that he is, like, amazing. He's not. I mean, I don't even have to say that because we all know he's not amazing. He's just okay. Okay? Solaire at home in Kansas City at only 4-1, too. That price is pretty damn cheap. Check this out. At 4-1, look at his, what his price just was on the 23rd. 5,000. 21st. 5,000. 20th. 52. 19. 55 like we're getting a huge discount on the dude and he just homered last game on the 25th like come on man 4-1 is too cheap for a guy who was just over 5k a few games ago okay so I'm gonna take that value for a guy who always has double dong potential so there I love him at 4-1 against Homer Bailey and that's it J.A. Happ, Sonny Gray, Ryan O'Hearn, Aaron Judge, and Jorge Soler I absolutely love him and I'm not sure if I'm saying Soler's name right but just bear with me, okay? If you know the way to really say his name, just repeat it to yourself. Like every time I'm about to say it, just correct it. And just so it makes you feel good. But I'm not going to spend too much time trying to make sure I get names right. Because I like to come on here and get you guys this juice and, and roll out. You feel what I'm saying? Greenlightdfs.com. Let's get straight into this uh, home run predictions, all right? I'm sure you guys can tell by my tone. I am super pumped up, man. I needed that win on Sunday so bad, man. I hate MLB at times because it can be tilting, man. I like I do so much studying just for shit to for guys to go out there and shit the bed in a perfect matchup. It's aggravating, but it is what it is. So let's go ahead and streak this shit out, go the entire week W's and, and make up for it. All right. Now, home run predictions. Gary Sanchez, Aaron Judge, and Glaber Torres. I've been talking about them them this entire time. I love all three of those dudes against Tommy Malone. They all match lefties. Definitely love them. All right. Um, Some of these names could be in the happy hour slate or the earlier slate. I'm going to say everybody I like throughout the entire day. Freddie Freeman, Nolan Arenado, Charlie Blackman, uh, Hunter Renfro, Reese Hoskins, Eugenio Suarez against Caleb Smith. I know he's solid, but it's still a lefty against Suarez. He can always get one against him. Christian Yelich, Marcel Ozuna. Paul Goldschmidt damn near made the high five, by the way. If you don't need the save with Ryan O'Hearn, which Ryan O'Hearn as of right now is my favorite value on the slate, but if you don't need to save that, because like I said, there's really nowhere we have to spend up, um, I do like going Goldschmidt there at first base, okay? I do love Goldschmidt against lefties. Against Gio Gonzalez, I love Paul Goldschmidt, as well as Marcelo Zuna. Logan Morrison against Joe Musgrove. The lefties of that Philly team are in a great spot against Musgrove, guys. All right, great spot. Um, just mentioned Paul Goldschmidt, love him. Yonder Alonzo going against Julio Teheran on, on the happy hour slate, I believe. Um, love him, lefty righty. You know Teheran struggles versus lefties. And then let's do more. AJ Pollock going against Eric Lore. Love AJ Pollock. Let's check his price real quick. What is Pollock's price? He's 4 4, so he's definitely okay to play for sure. Um, so I definitely, I don't like that he's more, that's what I'm saying, guys. He's 4-4 compared to Solaire at 4-1. Like, I got, like, I like Solaire more, for sure. All right, guys, thank you guys for joining me as always. Those are your home run predictions. Make sure you join me for the live show at 2.30 p.m. Central on this channel. Come talk DFS, man. Ask all the questions you want. Come see what other people are asking. Talk to other people in the chat, whatever you want to do. Just come join it. Have, have a good time before the slate starts. And hit up greenlightdfs.com, man. Let's sweep this shit.